Hi boys and girls, it's Miss Wojo here. I hope you guys are having a fabulous summer. Um, we've been doing a summer adventure out in St. Charles County lately with the uh, libraries. So we've been having a lot of fun. Um, I found this amazing book called America the Beautiful, which is amazing. It is, let's see. I get my information for you so you can know who it's by. So if you want to look it up, you can. It is by Wendell Miner with a poem by Katherine Lee Bates. So it shows all these amazing pictures in here while doing the song America the Beautiful. So the first page, oh beautiful for spacious skies, for amber waves of grain, for purple mountain majesties above the fruited plain. America, America, God shed his grace on thee and crown thy good with brotherhood from sea to shining sea. So that's the first verse that most people know really, really well. Um, the second verse continues on, talks about um, some historical things as we go through it. So the next one is, Oh, beautiful for pilgrim feet, whose stern impassioned stress, a thoroughfare for freedom beat across the wilderness. America, America, God mend thy every flaw. Confirm thy soul in self control, thy liberty in law. Moving on to the second verse. Mount Rushmore, that's awesome guys, so. Oh beautiful for heroes proved in liberating strife, who more than self their country loved, and mercy more than life. America, America, may God thy gold refine till all success be nobleness and every gain divine. Our next verse. Oh, beautiful for patriot dream that seems beyond the years. Thine alabaster cities gleam, undimmed by human tears. America, America, God shed his grace on thee, and crown thy good with brotherhood from sea to shining sea. So, one thing I loved about this book is not only does it cover the song America the Beautiful with such cute, gorgeous illustrations. They are so beautiful. Um, this was, hold on, this is published by Charles Bridge, which is a publication company. And, um, it is, one second, it provides us an introduction about Catherine Lee Bates, who wrote the original poem, and it also provides you some details be about the song itself. Um, history about Catherine Lee Bates, as well as Samuel Augustus Ward, um, who helped to write the the music to America the Beautiful. He's the composer of it. You guys all know a composer is someone who writes music, right? So it also tells you a little bit about each of the pictures. 
So if you guys go check this out at your local library, this is an amazing book to go check out. It gives you all the, it has highlights of all the beautiful places in this, like lit, pictured in this book. It's so cool. So go check out America the Beautiful. It's well worth it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you're having a great summer. Bye.